Hello, this is Stanford Smith with Pushing Social, and I'm just doing another tutorial for you today. Um, I actually started using a new widget, which I think you will enjoy a ton. Um, this widget actually, and I'll scroll down here so you can see it on the right hand side, actually displays the top commenters on my blog which is pushing social the reason why I love this widget is because one I love commenters and I love making sure that they understand that I appreciate them and I also want to provide a way for it to be fun for people to comment on my blog and I found that whenever I go to a blog and they keep track of their commenters and they actually rank them the competitive nature I have uh, makes me look at that and makes me appreciate it and I suspect that a lot of my readers are the same way so if you have come by my blog and you've actually commented um, looks like more than one time for this month um, you'll show up on this leaderboard here and I also used um, a little hack here or a little um, or it's not actually a hack it's actually a part of the widget I'm about to show you but you can actually put a image here by your top commenters which is a another added little bonus there for people who really um, are competitive and get into that type of thing so let me show you how to do it really quickly um, you're gonna have to know how to um, install a plugin um, to be able to do this or to install this widget so you can go back and look at the install a plugin video if you need a refresher course on that but so we're going to go through it pretty quickly here um, so you can get this up and running on your blog so the first thing you want to do is that you have to download the plugin and this particular plugin is called top commenters widget okay and you'll need to go to wordpress.org slash extend slash plugins um, and then when you get there you can actually search for the co top comment commentator widget um, so you can um, go ahead and find that and download it so when you hit the download here it'll take you through the process that I've gone over a couple of times um, in the install a plugin video but you want to go ahead and do that it'll do its business and download it to your hard drive and then you'll need to go to the next step which is to actually move that plug into your directory which I'll show you really quickly here so you can see here on the left hand side I have the top commentators widget okay and all you need to do is pull that over into the plugin into the plugin folder um, on your blog installer or your blog theme okay after you get done with that you just want to go over into the dashboard of your blog so in this case we're using the pushing social test and this should take it to exactly where we want to go okay so we're on the back end of our test blog I'll go back out to the front end so you remember how it looks like remember we've been working with this test theme which is the 2010 um, theme that comes default that comes as a default with WordPress so go back here and we'll go into um, plugins because we need to activate the plugin so we'll go here and you'll see here that our top commentators widget is here all we have to do is activate it and for this particular widget you have to if you want to manipulate it you actually go to the widgets underneath your appearance area so that's appearance widgets and you'll see here a box for you to pull over your top commentators widget so you just grab it and you'll pull it up and put it wherever you want to put it um, on your sidebar so let's say we want to put ours right at the top so we'll do that and once you drag and drop it there you'll be able to change a couple of attributes or a couple of configuration settings here first thing is that you can change the title of the widget so this is what people will see and on the second line you actually can add a description for the widget and then you can exclude certain users by default it excludes the admin which is usually the author so you don't want yourself to be viewed as the top comment commenter because I'm sure you are um, for your blog you can reset the leaderboard um, based upon hour day week month year I like to if you're gonna I like to actually set this to a month or a week's time depending upon how frequently you get comments the reason is is that we go to the beginning if I were to set this for a year um, I have some commenters who 
actually comment may have commented on my blog maybe a hundred times um, and I don't want it to be discouraging for a person who actually wants to get on this top 10 list to see that to get on the top 10 list they have to comment 50 times so what I've actually done is that I've set this limit to a month period which makes it a little bit easier and more attainable for people to get onto the top 10 list and you can set other things such as you can specify the days um, the exact number of days so if you want to say the top commenters for the last seven days you can do that you can limit the number of name you can limit the number of names I did it did it to 10 or you can have as many as you want limit the characters and the names usually you could just leave these two blank It's up to you here's a field here that you can put in some text if there are no commenters so if your blog is brand new you can put that there um, filter the following URL so if you if you need to use those and you know exactly what these two fields are about um, here and here you can go ahead and set those but you can leave them blank for now you can display your list as bulleted or numbered it's up to you hyperlink each name I usually do that so the person can get some credit for being on my list so um, they'll get some link love for me on there and you can go through each one of these the only one I want to kind of pull your attention to is this display gravatar I set it to yes so it actually pulls in their picture from the gravatar if they have one and the last thing is that award icon so here you can show an award if the comments are equal to a certain number so um, if you want to show an award to people who have actually commented more than let's say 50 times you can just go ahead and put 50 in this box and it will show it will show a nifty little award icon next to their name um, if you're just starting off and you know a lot of people are not commenting on your blog a lot then you can set that to a low number so I set it for five um, just so people can see you know so I can at least get a few people with the award icon next to their name um, and then you can align that align that icon however you like so you can set it before the gravatar picture or after the gravatar picture or all the way to the right it's up to you so that's pretty easy to set up and once you hit save there and there's no commenters on the test site so this is probably not a good example to show you on the front end but when you go out to the front end of your blog you'll see that on the right hand side you'll see your top commenters and since this is the is the default install this brand new Mr. WordPress is the first commenter you can see here that it has a actually the number of comments by their name as well so let's go back to pushing social so you can see it actually worked um, in its full glory here so you can see that um, Jen Winham has five comments for this month and I actually used a custom little image there to put by their names and you can actually set your custom image this is a 20 by 20 pixel image that I went out and just found and modify just a little bit and you can set that here let me show you really quickly um, we have to refresh that here we go you can go all the way down it says award icons image location all you have to do is that if you don't want to use the default one that's included you can actually type in a location on your heart on your server to a folder that has your particular image so if you have an images folder and you make a small 20 by 20 icon you can put in the images folder and then put in the URL to where that image folder is located you put it in right there and then you can get you can customize your images like I have here here's the gravatar images that we talked about and then each one of these are actually linked so when you click on it it will actually go to their Twitter page which I think is a really nice addition and a really nice way to help people who comment on your blog get some followers and this is showing the top 10 which is what we said on the back end and underneath here you can see that under the comment section or the description I put in a little once a month a gold star commentator um, is picked for a free blog review so this is a kind of a cool way to reward the people who engage with me on the blog so this is um, I think a great widget is very easy for you to set up in the stall and I think it's probably something that you want to set up and do on your blog as soon as you can alright and that is it for now talk to you next time